Hey, what's up? It's just Gems, and I was looking online and I found a story regarding the Black Creek descendants. They are suing the Muscogee Creek Nation, and I think this has been in the works for a couple of years, but today is the day that they present their case. Um, and I want to share some of the article with you. For, for hundreds of years, Black Creeks free and enslaved were important in the growth of the tribe and many held influential positions, including warriors, chiefs, teachers, interpreters, town kings, senators, lawyers, judges, and light horsemen or law enforcement. Yet, as the United States built and expanded the institution of chattel slavery, the so-called five civilized tribes, Cherokee, Creek, Choctaw, Chickasaw, and Seminole practiced slavery within their own jurisdictions. Now that we had heard, you know, we they always want to try to keep us all as oppressed minorities. We're all the same, but only one of us didn't own slaves, <laughs> you know? So they don't want us ever to say anything about Native American slavery and the role that they play. But actually, they were so cold with it. The Muscogee, they, um, they didn't even release their slaves in 1865. That's why they had the Treaty of 1866. And in that treaty, uh, according to Article 2 of the 1866 Treaty with the Creeks, Persons of African descent shall have and enjoy all the rights and privileges of native citizens, including an equal interest in the soil and national funds and the laws of the said nation shall be equally binding upon and given, I'm sorry, and give equal protection to all such persons and all others of whatsoever race or color who may be adopted as citizens or members of said tribe. So they're definitely in violation of this treaty, in my opinion, based on that information there. Because in 1979, they cut out the Black Creeks. They have refused to honor the treaty with the Black descendants. Um, notably, the U.S. government has failed to intervene as well, even though it played a crucial role in creating the conditions for discrimination when it forced the tribes to add their names to the Dawes Rolls, a list designating tribal enrollment. In order to force the tribes to practice land ownership, making it easier to divide up land for non-tribal use, the U.S. government established the Dawes Commission in 1893, according to the U.S. Department of the Interior. Aside from forcing tribal members to add their names on the rolls, it segregated Black Creeks by placing them on Creek Freedmen rolls. Even Black Creeks who were Creek by blood were forced into the segregated status, making it easier for the tribe to eliminate them as citizens decades later. And we all, well, a lot of us have heard of that Dawes rolls, and that's how a lot of these blonde-haired, blue-eyed, quote-unquote, Indians or Native Americans you see today because their family, their ancestors paid $5 um, to be added on that Dawes Road as an Indian so that they can have access to the tribal lands. Boy, they, mm, 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 I'm not even going to say it. But look at all what they've had to go through. It's been 43 years that they've been fighting this battle to be recognized. And you know there was a lot of mixing in these tribes. And they had slaves. They're no different than the white man. And you know that they had children with these slaves and, and all of that. So um, a lot of our Native American heritage is lost due to the U.S. government's intervention in creating those Dawes roles. I truly hope that the descendants do get what they are owed because it, it's not right. They played a major, their ancestors played a major role in the tribes, it sounds like. And also they were on the trail of tears. You don't hear too much about the black people that were on that trail of tears marching down to Oklahoma. They talk about the Native Americans, but they always want to keep us to where we're on the same level playing field. We're all minorities. We were all done wrong. <clears throat> but in actuality, some were done worse. <laughs> but let me know what you think in the comments. Make sure you hit the like button before you go and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And until next time, peace.